Hey there guys, welcome back to another um, adventure here with Jeep 877 Adventures. Um, so what today I'm doing here is um, I was made some boiled eggs today for, um, for lunch with work. Um, so I, I saved all the shells here and what I'm going to do is I got this little baggie. I'm going to crush up these shells and um, actually mix them in with the dirt uh, to help fertilize uh, my new cucumber, peppers and tomatoes I got growing on here and you'll kind of see what I got going on here today with that. So firstly I'm going to put them in here all the eggshells and then just kind of go ahead and uh, whoops, put a little this air out of it really get those nice and crunched up. A little damp right here on the table. I got a new uh, misting fan over here. As you may have noticed, I uh, redid a lot of my awning and things like that. Everything all, all new around here. Alright, so you just kind of get nice and messed up like this. You just kind of have to pull apart some with your fingers once you get in the dirt and kind of mix it with the dirt. So let's go ahead and see what we got going on now. Alright, so once you got that like that, I'm just going to take out the uh, uh, tagger up here that I have. And I got my little baggie right here. I'm going to take out a good little handful of the eggshells and just start to kind of get some like this and just kind of grab the dirt there and try to mix it in there as best as you can. And just like that, you just keep kind of going till you see where it's fit. I'm going to go ahead and continue and do the rest of that with the rest of the bone right now. And that's pretty much all to it. You know, I just went ahead and uh, mixed up that dirt really good with that fur with the um, eggs right there. That's pretty much my homemade um, fertilizer there. And uh, the other, they seem to be doing really good. And yeah, guys, you might have noticed there that I went ahead and uh, got these nice labels made on each one of these pots to now where it actually sits there and says cucumber peppers and tomato and showing you exactly what it is uh, that I'm growing. And uh, as far as my misting fan, um, it seems to be really be working to really cool off my deck and I really like it. So other than that, let's go ahead and feed the fish and we'll call it a wrap. And here we are back at the pond. And yes, the water lettuce has just overtook in my pond. <laughs> There's so much water lettuce growing in here. The lilies are doing great. The fish are doing great. As you can see, the water lettuce is even getting on this right here. As you can see, I ripped it off there so that that didn't happen. But, you know, these, these water lettuce, just, uh, they always seem to know how to find a way. Grab the food real quick here. And let's feed these fish. Oh, yes, they are very, very hungry. I feed them every morning and um, every afternoon. And I gave them just like a small little bit just to fill the bottom of this cup. You know, about up to about here. And that's with the uh, pond sticks I've been using right here. And uh, they seem to be enjoying it quite uh, quite well. So I just wanted to give you a quick little look though before we go of what the differences here is with the way that I just redid this awning thing. Um, as you can see previously right now that you're looking at, um, there's like a PVC pipes to go across, PVC pipes in the frame, and now what we're looking at is uh, these nice, nice wood uh, beams right here, and it kind of looks like perfectly flows together right here. And uh, let me take you with us here and give you a little show real quick of my beautiful looking little 
little um, vinery that I put up here. Put this nice vinery up here, all the way up and across and around. And then I topped off with, uh, which I already had, these uh, nice little Edison style uh, bulbs right there that goes around the whole little perimeter. Lights up really nicely. Everything's gonna be doing all real great. And then of course, you know, we went ahead and we built this and uh, just to help cool everything off, I went ahead and got this really nice misting fan from Lowe's. I definitely would recommend this. Um, not being sponsored or, you know, paid advertising for that, but uh, the brand of this one is, uh, let's see what it's called. Uh, utility tech, U utility tech, whatever. It's a Mister fan, and um, yeah, it seems to be doing really, really well. Um, and of course, I went ahead. And I've been buying all kinds of really nice new solar lights. I got these solar lights that have like a flame going on them. Uh, whenever it gets dark, and also I put these really nice uh, clover um, solar lights, and they do really well. And I got them on all of the areas around here to where uh, at nighttime these bushes just light up remarkably. And then of course over here on the trellises out front here, I got these nice little fairy lights and uh, it lights up my shed nicely. Overall, very happy with the way everything's turning out around here. So guys, stay tuned for another video because you never know what's happening around here. Always something new. Thanks guys.